The Americans benefited immensely from home court advantage. There are very few rules in warfare aphorisms that apply from one war to the next, but I do think that when you're fighting this kind of war, the margin of error for the occupying force, the force that is projecting power to another land and trying to determine the national identity of the people who live there in contravention of public will, that that force suffers under tremendous disadvantages, that it makes the slightest little mistakes, and they all come back to undermine the efforts they are making. Whereas the Americans who have that home court advantage are able to make innumerable mistakes over the course of the war, and yet they're able to recover from nearly every one of those. And they're able to do so because they have a press that in general is more sympathetic to them and is willing to give them the benefit of the doubt, who don't take American missteps and blow them up into propaganda victories for the enemy, and the British have exactly the opposite situation to deal with. Every mistake they make, American journalists, American propagandists are going to turn that into a massive public relations fiasco that's going to put victory further and further out of reach.